to my Patreon page, which is patreon.com forward slash Elliot Wave Green. I'm your host, Shaheen. I have got amazing news, and uh, there is a high probability setup that we are seeing in crude oil. Uh, the news is that the prices of crude oil are expected to go down in the next uh, two weeks, at least we can say. Uh, and we can, uh, I have done some underlying status as well, and I can confirm, I wanted to confirm the uh, the patterns that I can see uh, from Naked Eye, and I wanted to confirm, and I have now a confirmation now. Uh, we need a confirmation signal though before we can actually go. But one thing is uh, really looking really good on an hourly time frame first of all. Uh, if you are uh, even a bit of a, uh, a bit aware of Elliott Wave analysis then you can probably see Wave 1, 2 and 3. If you cannot see then you probably can see Wave A, Wave B and Wave C where Wave C is a, uh, a 5 wave structure so basically giving us a fl expanded flat structure. So Wave A here, Wave B here and Wave C here. <coughs> Pardon me. As per Elliott Wave uh, analysis guidelines, now if uh, most often Wave 3 is the strongest and subdivisible, uh, but if it is not, then uh, the guideline, this is not a rule, it's a guideline, and then the uh, one of the, uh, the impulse wave is then uh, further least uh, subdivisible. And that's what you expect to, uh, to see from this behavior. We have seen uh, wave 1 right over here, so we can label it right now. If Let me see if we can uh, find a little... So we can call it wave 1 and wave 2, and we have wave 3 right over here and wave 4. Uh, do not worry about the disproportion of the wave 2 and wave 4. It does happen from time to time, and it also is working out as an accumulation pattern, or rather distribution pattern. We have seen huge distribution of uh, funds going on right now, giving us an indication that we are looking for wave 5 to be subdivisible. It's going to take its time, and we are going to see a clearly five wave structure it will be subdivisible we are looking for a low below this low right over here and we're looking for a clear five wave structure um, this is not exactly the path but the price should actually look like uh, something like this so we are gonna see something like this probably and then we'll see uh, a stronger wave down right over here and then we'll see probably another correction right over here and uh, giving us an indication that we can actually go down. All of this is going to be uh, the future past. It's going to be giving giving us an indication that we are going to see a clearly fi uh, subdivisible fifth wave. Uh, another thing here is I wanted to indicate is the most important. Uh, if you want to take risk, it's up to you. Uh, but we should wait for the confirmation of the break of the trend. We should because in rare cases this price can go on and on a little. We can see a little extension going even further down, uh, which would make person some pattern something else right now. So the previous low that we have seen is right over here. Uh, here is the previous low. This is the second low, the third low, and I'm expecting that the price soon would fall below this one, this trend line, giving us an indication that the fifth wave is complete of the the wave C structure. And that will be our indication that we can go short. Once again, if you do go short, do understand that a bump up may uh, be, be expected uh, to retest the, the support. So that's, uh, once again, it's uh, very clearly uh, one of those moments when uh, price structure gives you clear indication of what is expected. And I'm seeing a bearish trend coming in uh, crude oil and it's very good news for the world because I'm living here in Canada and believe me when I tell you gas is really expensive. By the way, here in America, they call it gas. You, do, you don't call it oil or petrol uh, as said in Asia, I think. And in England as well, I've, I've seen there. But in, in America, they call it gas. So gas is expensive and <laughs> so is my vehicle running now. I hope to see the prices down. Wish you good luck with your trading. Once again, I'm seeing a clearly price structure and my underlying research is also giving us an indication that it is actually wave A, B and C where wave C is uh, quite extended. We can see uh, this that the, confirm the confirmation would come by the break of this trend line uh, and or you know if you want this is a 15 minute chart so you can actually fine tune it and uh, it's better idea not to fine-tune it honestly uh, you want to con you want to confirm in a better in a uh, better way that, that the trend upward is complete and that should confirmation should come uh, right somewhere right around over here okay 
somewhere around here the, the break of the trend line would occur and this will give us an indication that we have completed that the trend line uh, the, the structure right above over here and believe me this one is going to take some time we are going to expect it from 8 to 10 days uh, maybe a little more uh, but 8 to 10 trading days is going to be very very good trading setup It's also giving us a chance that if someone is actually bullish uh, on the break of this pattern they can confirm now that they the previous impulsive structure is complete. Wish you good luck with your trading. Have a good one and bye-bye.